If you're interested in increasing your business's revenue by up to 40% and making your paid advertisements way more effective, then this is the video for you. Today, I'm gonna to be talking about flows within Klaviyo. I'm Stephanie Parks. I am one of the founders of The Media Captain. Our digital marketing agency also um, is one of the the very one of the only marketing agencies to also have started an e-commerce business. Uh, that e-commerce business is called Durham Warehouse. We have used Clavio for the past several years, and within that platform, we have amassed hundreds of thousands of dollars from the flows that we have set up. One of the most important that you want to start with is your welcome series flow. This is going to get you into the whole flow game on Clavio, and today we're going to go into everything you need to know about the welcome series. Okay, so first thing we need to get into is what exactly is a welcome series flow. Any flow in Klaviyo is a series of emails that automatically get sent out to your customers based on certain triggers. So the welcome series flow is going to be sent out when somebody signs up for emails on your website. So you've probably gone to many different websites and seen a pop-up come up on the site. And I'm going to take you to the Durham Warehouse site. Again, this is our e-commerce business, so I'm going to use this as an example. You can see on the Durham Warehouse site right here that this is our pop-up. We are offering our customers 20% off of their order, and all that they have to do is put in their email, and they receive a code via email. This pop-up is so important because when you are spending any money to drive traffic to your site, so let's say you have Google ads running, let's say you have Facebook ads running, you're spending money to get people to your site. Not everyone's going to convert right away. So for those that don't, you want to make sure that you are capturing their email, even if they do convert one way or another, emails are so valuable. So you want to make sure that any traffic that you're driving to your site, you have a great offer, promotion, something really enticing to get people to put their email address in. So somebody is going to come to the Durham Warehouse site, they're going to put their email address in this in this pop-up, and then that's going to fire off our Klaviyo flow. So I'm going to go over to Klaviyo now, and I'm going to show you exactly what this looks like. Okay, so we're in Klaviyo now, and you can see the first step of any flow. This is what a flow looks like. It's a series of emails, and it has different time delays, different conditions that will enable emails to go off to your customers. So the first thing that every single flow starts with, no matter what it is, is called a trigger. And this is what will, like it says, trigger the email to go out. So our pop-up on the Durham Warehouse site when someone enters their email address, it automatically subscribes them to a list on Klaviyo called pop-up and newsletter. Then as soon as somebody enters that list, it triggers this flow. So if I wanted, I could add different conditions here. I could say, you know, I want, I want to wait 30 minutes before sending this email out. Or I only want this to go to people who have never shopped with us before. So you can add any conditions that you want. For us, anybody who puts that email address into the pop-up, I want them to get this email. So that's, you know, that's the trigger. And then you can see it goes immediately into email number one. So let me open this up. Again, this email, whatever promotion, whatever the verbiage you have in this email should match the promotion or whatever you're offering on your pop-up. You don't want to offer 20% on your pop-up and then have an email saying, here's a 10% off coupon. Um, so make sure that that matches up if you're having different promotions or sales throughout the year. This is definitely a mistake that I've made. Don't forget to either change your welcome series flow or have different flows and different pop-ups for different situations. So for the welcome series, I like to keep these emails pretty simple. Don't overthink it. People have already put their email address in on your site. They're interested in whatever offer you're giving away. Now you just wanna give them the coupon code and get them to place an order. So you can see it's our subject line is really simple, 20% off at Durham Warehouse. Welcome to the Durham Warehouse family. And within email number one, I'm gonna open this up. Within email number one, I very clearly at the top put what the promotion is, put a little message, give them a code, and then allow them to shop now. You'll see a lot of brands have a, you know, a fancy image here, which you can do, but the most important thing is whatever that offer is, whatever is gonna excite them, in this case, it's the 20% off promotion, make sure you're 
putting that at the very top. Otherwise, you might lose people just in the scroll. Um, like I said, this email is super simple. Then we have different categories that people can shop. They can shop our top brands. I always make sure to put restrictions within the email. For example, some of our brands don't allow a 20% discount. So we have a link to the brands that are excluded. We want to make sure people know that they can only use one discount code per order, things like that. Um, so that's email number one. And then we're going to go into email number two. I'm gonna wait one day for that email to go out. Klaviyo has standards. So when, when you sign up for Klaviyo and when you go into the platform, they'll give you templates for any of these flows. In terms of the time delays, I usually go with what they say. They have you know millions of customers, however many customers they have. So they know really like what works well. And so I usually stick with those. So after one day, we want to make sure our conditional split is has placed order zero times since starting the flow. So we don't want people to get this email if they already placed an order after email number one. We only want this email to go out to people who didn't place an order after they received the first email. This looks pretty similar. Um, we give them the 20% off, don't miss out. And on this, we kind of simplified it even more. We're telling them not to miss out and then we're listing some of our brands down here. So again, super simple message. You don't need to overcomplicate this. If there's product information that you wanna include or videos that you wanna include, you can put them in here. But again, don't make it so complicated that people are getting distracted from the main point, which is we want them to come back to the site and we want them to place an order. Um, in my experience, once you get to email three, the the revenue tends to really drop off and it just doesn't produce as well. So you can see here that I've actually turned off email number three because it just wasn't producing the results that we wanted. Um, so we have a two email, super simple flow for the welcome series. Something else really cool that you can do is you can add SMS into this. We have SMS incorporated into some of our other flows like our abandoned cart and browse abandonment. I didn't feel it was necessary for the welcome series, but if you want, you can incorporate SMS in here. You can have this go to you know anybody who is subscribed for SMS will get a text message. If they're not subscribed, they'll get an email. So you can really play around with this welcome series, but it is such an important flow. We have amassed so much revenue from having this flow set up. And number one, it's such a good way to collect email addresses. You can set up your pop-up form right in Klaviyo. It's, it's really easy to do. Um, so we're collecting email addresses. We're sending off a really good promotion. And then for anybody who's not purchasing even after this flow, we can choose to remarket to them down the road. Okay, now I kept telling you that you were gonna amass a ton of revenue for your flows. And you're probably wondering, how do you measure that? Something else that's amazing about Klaviyo is they have really good analytics. So you can come into any one of your flows and here you can see, I'm clicking on email one, I can see that 1,834 of these have been sent out over the last 30 days. You can see it has a 30% open rate, a 4% click rate, and we've amassed five and a half $5.5 thousand dollars in revenue from this email. You can go into here and you can drill down on more analytics. So there's just really great data and information. You can, uh, one of my favorite things is that you can come in and click on the link activity. So of all of the links that you're putting in your email, you can see who's clicking on what and what they're most interested what they're most interested in. So I can see clearly people are most interested in the skincare category. That might be something that I want to promote more in other emails. Um, also, just within your Klaviyo dashboard, you can, and let me get out of here for a second, within your Klaviyo dashboard in the home section, it's really nice because you can see how your all of your flows are doing, the revenue they're amassing, you can see how they're doing compared to the previous month. So there's a lot of great data in here. Um, one thing to, to keep in mind about the welcome series flow is that for us on our pop-up, when you put your email address in, um, 
we show our code on the last on the on the thank you page of our pop up. We don't want to risk losing people even in the time it takes them to go from the pop up to their email and then back to our site. I don't know about you, but I get distracted every time I open my inbox. So we get we chose to give them the code right there on on the success screen of the pop up. So our revenue for this welcome series flow is likely much higher than five thousand dollars because we have people who are just using the code directly from the pop-up so that's something to keep in mind when looking at your um your analytics for your welcome series flow i hope you found this video on the welcome series flow for clavio very helpful this is something that has been a game changer for our business and i'm sure once you dig into this you'll see it'll be a game changer for yours too Make sure to follow The Media Captain on YouTube if you want more Clavio tips, more digital marketing tips. And if you have any questions, you can reach out to us at themediacaptain.com.